Yeah. James, your first goal of the season for Spenny Moore, um but I mean, kind of scratching our heads how we didn't kind of win that game. Is the frustration the same in the dressing room? Yeah, we're frustrated because we feel like we should have won the game, but we're also taking a lot of positives from it. Um, we created numerous chances, we looked dangerous all day. Um, should have had more goals, should have been more ruthless. Um, myself, Boise, others, you know, we know we've got to put the goals away, but, but so many positives to take. So we are frustrated that we haven't won the game, but heads certainly aren't down. Uh, you know, chins are up, ready for, for Tuesday. And, and as I say, massive positives from the game, and, and we're looking forward to the next one. And in terms of yourself, you've got to be quite patient over the past few weeks and kind of waiting for your chance. And obviously, we're all disappointed with Glenn's injury, but you, you got your chance today up alongside Boise. And do you think with the goal and with your performance overall, do you think you've kind of warranted a place in the start 11 now? Um, you know, that's that's to the manager's discretion. That's not for me to say. Um, I can only go and do what, what I'm asked to do on the pitch, the same as every other player. Um, <coughs> excuse me. And um, as the gaffer said rightly in there, everyone today were, were eights, nines out of tens. Uh, you know, two corners have cost us. You know, we know it's uh, something we need to work on. But, but as I've said, I'm really pleased with the way I've played today. But most importantly, the way the team played today was, was excellent. We looked dangerous every time we went forward. Um, yes, we should have had more goals. But as I said earlier, the positives to take from it are, are numerous and, and, and we're really pleased not with the result, you know, a point's okay, but we're really pleased with the performance. And you played alongside Boise there, obviously the first time you've probably played together, um, so how do you think your partnership kind of worked, because it seemed to work really well from the, the first minute there? Yeah, I mean, it's a little like chalk and cheese, me and Boise, one's a hold-up striker, one goes in behind, but, but we like to think that that each other can do both, and, and, and that, that really works, because defenders don't know whether to, to stick or twist almost. Um, you know, I'm, I'm quite a versatile player, I like to think, so I can play play with quite, quite a few players in, in quite a few positions. So t today up front with Boise, I thought Boise was incredible. Again, you know, the, the same as he was when he, when he came on at Gateshead, holding the ball up, getting in behind, winning flick-ons, and, and it worked to my advantage today, and, and they didn't quite latch onto it, uh, and, and we should have taken more advantage of it uh, with a few more goals, but but I'm, I'm really pleased with the way the performance of, of the whole team, not just, just myself and Boise. I thought we were, we were both good, but I thought the whole team, everyone was, was fantastic. And kind of the only thing that's kind of missing at the minute is, is kind of stop conceding sloppy goals. I mean, two more from corners to it's been our Achilles heel this season. Obviously, a bit of frustration in the dressing room there. Once them errors are kind of eradicated from the game, then things will start to click and wins will start to come. Yeah, definitely. And, and that's something we're, we're well aware of. You know, we're not ignoring the fact that that, that seems to be an Achilles heel at the moment. Um, and, and we know we need to address it. It's something that we're working on in training, but it's not something that's going to happen overnight. You know, it's something that's got to progressively get better. Um, again, rightfully said in the dressing room, the back four were, were incredible today and didn't actually have that much to deal with. Yes, they've hit the post twice from, from two world-class balls in. But other than that, they haven't actually had to work that hard when it comes, well, sorry, they have had to work hard, but they haven't had to do as much as, as maybe the scoreline suggests. Two corners is frustrating, but again, I thought the back four were, were solid today and, and we are frustrated with the result. But as I say, from, from front to back, the performance from, from everyone, you know, everyone that came on, everyone that played was really, really good.